WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of very sunny and pleasant Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update, and we've got a mixed bag out there. The mix goes like this. you got the Dow. Well, all the indices are trading the downside with the exception of the New York Stock Exchange. And New York Stock Exchange is trying to uh, form a uh, bottom. We're going to take a look at that advanced client oscillator, certainly during during the uh, Trader's Edge show. we got the Dow down 35, S&P's off 6, NASDAQ's down 72, Russell's off 2, Semi's down 67, Tranny's really having a tough day, down nearly 2%. Down 285 points. You've got gold that's off a buck, and silver's up 37 cents out there. There's some divergence. Light to recruit is off 68 pennies. Natural gas is down a nickel. 30 year treasury is up 10 ticks. Printed out at 114.09. Let's figure out what all that means by looking at that nine panel. Market update chart. We begin with the ES mini upper left hand side. We've got that A to B equals CD pattern to the downside. It's next price projection will be 50.55. That is, unless we see a bullish reversal candle. So far today, we've taken out, did we take out yesterday's high? Yesterday's high in the ES was 51.23, no, 51.20 today. Uh, spot volatilics is trading lower, but still above its 50-day exponential moving average. That always creates problems or can create problems for the S&P 500. The NQ has made the one-to-one -one price level. That's at 17.861. Its next downside price target would be 17.682. That is, unless a bullish reversal candle forms. U.S. dollar index on its way to its one-to-one -one A to B equals CD at the 106.53. I don't think that's where it stops. I think it heads up towards the one. 732 level. That would be the 1.272 expansion of that A to B leg. If we take a look at Goldilocks, yesterday gold closed above the top of its profile. That's at 2400. It's trading above it as we speak today. As long as it remains above 2400, price should go ahead and gravitate up towards the high of last Friday. And that's up at the 2448 level. Silver is forming a new profile. Now, silver yesterday actually confirmed a sell the D point pattern when it generated that dark cloud cover candle. Um, a close above that high, that high. 2910 would negate that signal. At 2902, you've got profile resistance. In the case of Light Sweet Crude, just trading in between its profiles. That found support this morning. And the support is a zone. The zone is 8409 to 8480. Resistance up at the top of that profile, which is also a TD9 count top. That's at the 8763 area. Natural gas. It is uh, testing its swing point low from back here in uh, February, February 20th, 2024. That's at a buck 93. Yesterday, test to reject that level, but you close below it. That would suggest we're headed lower. And here in the 30 year treasury, you can see the longer term A to B equals CD pattern. Price formed and made that one to one price projection level. And if we do get a bullish reversal candle day's end, we should see a rally up towards the bottom of its profile around 118.22. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader's Ed show, if you will. But if you're off to start your Wednesday, please have a wonderful one. Thanks for joining us, and we'll look forward to speaking with you again soon. Take care now. In the world